G'day everyone. While reminiscing, I've been crafting stuff and this base I managed to craft for only 300 flame sand, which is obscene luck. There's only one major problem with, uh, with this base and I'll show you. It's not in uh, season. <laughs> so even though I got insanely lucky, um, I just want to see without any uh, care for deleting currency, because as you can see, most of this stuff doesn't exist in the game anymore. Um, what the chances of getting a godly item are. Uh, it's going to suck if I get it on here. Um, <laughs> and then don't have any luck in uh, standard. So I've actually got a bunch of plasticity that I'm not going to use because I want this removed and I want this removed. Um, so, yeah. I guess I could level this up just because. There we go. It's tier two. Delete some currency just because we can. Um, <clears throat> although we want these affixes to be removed by upgrading to tier zero. Anyway. So we'll do cooldown and recovery first. Hopefully it doesn't remove spell. Okay. We got one. Um, confirm. Now we want to upgrade spell skill. And there is a 1 in 3 chance that this succeeds and removes the spell crit strike rating. Uh, but there is a 2 in 3 chance that it removes aura effect or cooldown recovery speed. So let's do it. And it removed aura. Still, it's not a bad base. And now because we have 4,000... Um, uh, flame Elementium, or had, anyway, we can try and put on uh, things that are good. So we've got uh, that. Shame that's not gone. We'd like Aura Effect. Um, skill Radius. Double damage would be nice. <clears throat> so Spell Skill, Cooldown, Aura, uh, oh, oh the, the main one that I completely spaced for a second, this one. So this is the main one that I want. Don't show. Tier 1, it's not good enough. You want tier 0. So let's just see... Spamming this, uh, it's much easier to spam this in non-season because I don't care about the 4,000 flame balance here. Whereas if I was doing this on uh, season, I would happily take one of those tier ones. Um, which you're getting quite often actually, which is interesting. So the chances are meant to be 3.5% chance for tier 1. Um, but it's happening about every 5 or 6 rolls. Now it's not going to happen at all. Because I said that. Tier 2. Tier 2. Bum, 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 bum. So, so far we're down about 900 Flame Elementium. Uh, we did manage to get tier 0 additional spell damage. So now we've got 
tier zero spell, tier zero additional, tier zero uh, cooldown recovery speed. So that's quite nice. Um, aura effect would be super nice as well. We've got a 1.75% chance of hitting tier zero um, or a pretty decent chance of hitting something. 54% uh, chance um, to get one of them on there. Um, so if we fail this, then we're going to have to um, chuck additional spell damage back on there again, which is going to be super expensive. Um, but here's a... We'll go at it. Blemish, unfortunate. And then the next one that we would put on... Um, Oh, suffixes are full, so I can't do that one. Derp. So we'll just go with spell damage as the other prefix. So spell skill level, additional spell damage, and flat spell damage. Um, we only got tier 5, but we got a blemish down here, so we need to redo the additional um, spell skill, which is a shame. But... We've got a bunch of Reforge Craft. So we'll just go until we get T zero again. Oh, thank you, Ruby. So if you're doing this on Season, you can imagine how much Flame Elementium you're just deleting uh, constantly, trying to get that perfect item. Uh, next time I hit Tier 1, I might just do the other two, just to see what results we get. So Tier 1, it's still pretty decent, right? Do Spell Damage, got Tier 5 and uh, aura effect, blemish, reforge, and go again. So even when you hit tier zero, the chances then, oh, there we go. So that took another 1500. No, it took about 600 more. So we were down to about 3100, I believe. So about 600 Flame Elementium to get Tier 0 again. Um, and on Season, that would be a pretty decent base, um, honestly. And then it doesn't really matter what else you put on there. It's still a pretty nice item. Um, aura Effect, got Tier 3, nice. And Spell Damage, Tier 5. That's a pretty decent item in um, Season, but we've still got another... 2500 um, flame elementium there. So let's go again. Oh, tier 1 already. Chuck a spell and an aura on there. Well, tier 1 aura. That's pretty lucky. Uh, tier 1 additional cast and tier 3 spell damage. That's a pretty nice item. Honestly. That's pretty darn good. But is it good enough for this video? I don't think so. Um, if I was going to use this item, then sure, it'd be good. But let's just see if we can get out of 4,000 Flame Elantium a tier 0 T1 T1. I don't think so. <laughs> that would be crazy like we got tier zero again um which you get pretty often uh, aura tier one spell tier three fuck that's nice oh <laughs> i want that on season guarantee if i do this with 2000 flame elementium on season my stress levels will be exponentially higher and I won't get anything this nice uh, let's keep going or 
I have got another base. Let's do the other base and see what we get. Compare the two. Um, where is it? Someone was selling these bases for um, 30 flame elementium, which is crazy when the cost of things on season is absolutely mental. I won't bore you with this part. I'll be right back. What is with this RNG? Holy shit. I took 200 flame sand to get tier 1 cooldown recovery. I had the 3 spell sp skill and I got aura. So, tier 1 aura, tier 1 cooldown, tier 1 spell. Now we've got a uh, a pretty high chance of... Well, there's a 50-50 chance that this doesn't brick. So do cooldown recovery speed first. Okay, now we have a 1 in 3 chance of uh, this removing the mana. Wow! <laughs> Man! Oh, this is so good, but so disappointing that this is not on season. Oh, man. I'm using up all of my luck right now. Uh, spell damage. Additional spell damage. And suffix of... Um, what's the suffix? My brain stopped working. Aura. CDR. Skill radius, maybe? Ah, oh, spells crit. Duh. Um, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? 480 percent. Uh, this one. Oh man. So it's a tier one spell, tier three crit, tier two. Hmm. Reforge. Tier one immediately. That's pretty crazy. Tier six, tier six. Tier zero. <clears throat> so three tier zero, one tier one. Man. Crazy. Oh. <laughs> that base though, plus six, cooldown, aura. That's pretty insane. Uh, and these two are just bonuses, really. Uh, tier five and. Um, So this weapon is pretty mental. Um, I just wish it was on season. It saddens me <laughs> a lot that this is not on season. Um, good aura effect, pretty reasonable cooldown recovery speed, roll very high, additional cast speed, that's kind of bad, but it's a secondary stat, really. An aura effect. So that is insane. The other one that we crafted is also pretty decent. Um, why has it got missing spots? Did I not? What the hell? What's going on there? Where is it? Yes, that was the other one. Isn't it? No, that's the good one. 
that's the other one which we need to target process it's weird that it made the other stuff disappear <coughs> need that to be 6 uh, which is good 80 which is blah. so it's interesting to see that with uh, about we got 1800 left alrighty so out of about 2500 um, flame elementium I think we got insanely lucky uh, with this unfortunately this is standard um, so I won't actually be using either of these uh, I just want to alrighty attempt number three at the outro um, so <clears throat> I have attempted about five or six starves in season and not once have I managed to hit two tier zeros and one tier one uh, as per the um, staff on the left. And then just, just hitting that extra tier zero makes that an insane weapon. And then to also hit a tier one and who cares about this one, um, is quite insanely lucky, I think. Um, to get either of these weapons for under three or four thousand flame elementium would be quite good, and you could sell them on season for an absolute mozza. Um, so yeah, I, I wish I had either of these on season, um, but. I wish I had this on season. Look at that. Eight additional focus blessing stacks. Whew. I wish I had most of this gear on season, honestly. Um, but you can't get stuff like this anymore. Um, awesome rings. Uh, actually. Prototype. <laughs> I can make these better because of um, the new season. So I can just upgrade this to 90%. It deletes one, right? It got rid of um, max life. Okay, got rid of max life, who cares? Go here, max life, craft, reforge until we get to zero. Bum, 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 bum. Come on. It's gonna be harder to get tier zero on this than it was to complete that other staff, is it? Uh, what do we got? We're at 1580 FE. Alrighty, there we go. It took another 180 flame elementium to get an even better ring. Let's do it to the other one as well, because why not? Uh, okay, that's definitely not what that should be saying. Um, so we want to upgrade the minion damage. It got rid of fire res. Which is fine. Targeted. Suffix. Fire. It took quite a bit to get tier 0 <laughs> fire res on that, actually. Um, but anyway, at this point I'm just deleting currency because I can. <coughs> Excuse me. So, yeah. Getting any of this stuff on season would be pretty mental. Um, it's pretty nice as well. But anyway, that's what I have for that video. Um, hopefully I can have RNG similar to this on season. Um, getting that for such a small amount is, uh, pretty insane. There's going to be none. But yeah, so anyway, <laughs> interesting video. I'll see you later.